like the most painful thing in the world is is uh, food wastage right i think uh, one of the core reasons why i left my job as a five star hotel chef was uh, uh, because i felt i was part of a system that was so so wasteful uh, just to please or just for just so that some uh, the privileged few don't have a little bit of displeasure right. uh, so i mean i'll give you a, a small example i mean uh, i'm i'm not going to say much and there was a big event at a five star hotel where i was cooking it was an event for about 1000 people and uh, you know of course there were like 40 dishes on the menu and uh, yeah. just out of and, curiosity yeah, and, and which hotel end, was that uh, it was the hotel i used to work at it was itc grand goa okay so and uh, i at the end of this event uh, i was in charge of closing up shop and then packing up everything and leaving and uh, this event for 1000 people ended quite early and when i checked the food that was remaining after this event i realized that this was enough food for, to feed another 1000 people man and it, it it just baffled me the kind of uh, i mean and and the standard procedure for such a, a fu- hotel function is you can't serve the stale food uh, next True. day to another paying guest right is to is to dump it out you can't give it off to an ngo because you know the hotels don't want to be liable for any kind of litigation afterwards if someone gets poisoned Correct. with this food or or anything so the standard procedure is to dump it out and, and dumping that that <laughs> food out it just put so much pain in my heart i just i just couldn't i couldn't accept that i am part of a system that is so so flawed and i just refuse to you know uh, cut, um, go down that path Uh, so this is just one very small example i mean the wastages happen from every little stage